now. That's all we've got time for today. One man the focus of attention. A day for the debutant. Today he's named on the starting 11 for the very first time. How will he get on? We're live on EA TV. Well, most of the fans in attendance here have had to bring their umbrellas and wear their raincoats. It's a soggy day for this match. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And you can really sense the anticipation in the crowd ahead of kickoff with their respective league seasons about to get underway. It's Exeter City against the Blades. Opportunity! And not cleared away properly. In it goes at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper won't be proud of that moment. So the action continues, and let's find out if the Blades can wipe out that last goal. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And a strong tackle. Attacking possibilities for the Blades. Oh, breezing past him. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. But it is a special moment for the 16-year-old, a chance to impress in his full senior debut. Let's see how it a goes. A big moment here, Derek. And he's done it! Parate again! A magnificent game unfolding. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Moving into the advanced position. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Now, the situation has changed in one of the other games I'm hearing. Let's go to Alex Scott. Yeah, it's a goal for Crawley Town. It's now 1-0 with 12 minutes on the clock. Many thanks, Alex. And Brown in possession. Oh, 
a terrific piece of goalkeeping. Trying to pick out a teammate. No nonsense clearance. Oh, fancy footwork. Throw ins given. It's with Dieng. Good looking sequence. But ultimately, up a cul de sac. Now can they counter clinically? And the pass could do damage. In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Well, he's given it away. Could be threatening. Might go ahead. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. Well, just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Now, I believe changing circumstances in one of the other games. Alex Scott will tell us more. It's a goal for Colchester United. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 24 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. A bit sloppy in possession. Oh, he's through here. Oh, there it is. A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted merely minutes. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Nicely timed tackle. Oh, a nice looking pass. Real chance. He can't hold on to it. Attacking possibilities for the Blades. That's a nice looking ball. Well, still an issue here. Might be able to get in behind the defence. In it goes! He scored on his debut. And his fans are loving that. Well, as you can see, he just couldn't get enough on it. He'll be frustrated with that one. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. And going short with it. On and on he goes, and the keeper was up to the task. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. And now the delivery. Well, he couldn't get the header on the target, but robust defending. Well, not great from the keeper. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, there it is! The mistake punished to the maximum, and the goalkeeper left distraught. Huge error. Well, let's take another look, and it certainly doesn't improve, does it? The less said about that, the better. It's a poor mistake. Well, I imagine there were many who had counted them out. This has been quite the fight back. Well, I believe a spot kick award in one of the other games. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yes, it was a penalty for Barrow. Oh, 
surely. Oh, a goal. A double in his debut. Off to a flying start with the club. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. Well, if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Oh, what an opportunity. Well, I think fair to say, Stuart, not one for his personal scrapbook. Well, that's really wayward. His technique completely let him down there. What can the Blades do from this position? And it might be... That is a tackle and a half. Can he make it count? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Excellent challenge. Now what can they do from here? And in with a real chance. Oh, he saved it. Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Now with Taylor, Jay. And with that, the first half draws to a close. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. And dispossessed. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. And deliver towards the back post. Oh, but claimed by the goalkeeper. Going well. Can he put it in? Still could be dangerous. Opportunity here. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, here's the replay, and when you've got the ball at the back, you've got to pass it forward. And he doesn't do that there, he has his pocket fixed, and he's been rightly punished. Not a scoreline we see all that often, 5-3. Booth, attacking possibilities for the Blades. Can he take the chance? And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! Well, as you can see, he's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a play he is. 
So back with the action. The blades are buoyant. It's starting to get out of hand. And a goal has gone in in one of the other matches. Alex Scott will tell us more. It's another goal. In position. Another goal. The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Well, we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. Well, apologies for interrupting, Alex. To confirm, the visitors did find a net in that game, and they're in front at the moment by two goals to one. Possession lost by the Blades. 30 minutes to go then. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, we have a goal to tell you about in one of the other matches. Alex has the news. Yep, it's a goal for Newport County. They are now down 2 1 with 60 minutes on the clock. Thanks as always, Alex. Another story that's been covered extensively on television and the newspapers and on social media. Angel Correa has completed his move to Spurs. Well, at around £40 million, I think that's good value. Because if he does produce his best form, then they've signed a really good player. One that will certainly improve oh, sure. their team. So they might be onto something. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And now they have the ball back. Jones. Barrett. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in one of the other games, and Alex Scott can fill us in. It's another goal for Oldham Athletic. It's now 3 1 with 70 minutes on the clock. Alex keeping us right up to date. Not much time to make up his mind. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. And a poor ball. It's with Dieng. Jonathan drowns. He made it look simple, really. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Ball's gone. And he might be through here. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. This might be ideal for the counter. how to rob them of possession looking confident with the ball at his feet well that effort was always going wide he's not going to be best pleased with himself and it is substitution time at this juncture not just from one side but from both and great use of the ball to keep possession No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Chance to attack using it. 
players waiting in the centre. And the problem not completely solved. Well, nothing untoward happened. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. Well, he likes to run at them. And pushed away to safety. Taking it away. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. And a useful cross. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, it's a good result to start the campaign. Always... Some questions regarding the match? Thank you for answering the questions.
Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live coverage of the Carabao Cup. It's the Blades and they take on Gillingham. Well, Derek, it's a nice break from league action today for these clubs. Obviously a long way to go in the tournament. The final is months away, but they want to put in a good performance and get through to that next round. Could play it in. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Well, real excitement here. I say that because it's his long-awaited debut coming up. What should we be looking for from him, Stuart? Well, he's certainly got pace. He'll also be expected to get forward when he can, help provide those overlapping runs, and give his opposite number a real headache. It's a good bit of business, and I'm looking forward to seeing him play today. Barrett. Baldock. He's in behind. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? A bit sloppy in possession. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. Wonderful tackle. Already closing him down here. It is to be a throw-in. Losing possession here. And giving it away. Nice switch of play. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Nicely timed tackle. And showing fine vision. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And taken away, he won the ball. Well, visionary passing. And that's the way to keep the ball out of the net. Well, he doesn't get enough on it, does he? That's too easy for the goalkeeper, I think. Moving it forward. Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was
beaten far too easily on that occasion. Lee. Effective challenge. There's a slide draw pass. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Can they trouble the opposition this time? But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Well, there it is. The hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw-in to come. And space for the cross. And a timely intervention. And that was a very fine read. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. George Baldock. Giving the ball away. It's a weighted pass. And how about that for a save? He's driven in the corner. And still dangerous. Foiling his opponent completely. Crisp tackling. Could be. And the keeper more than equal to it. Very quick thinking there. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So into the second half, the Blades with a slender advantage. Let's see what this half has in store for us. Getting in there to intercept. And they have possession again. Good tackle. And there the attack ends for now. Well, Arsenal fans, no doubt about it, very excited given the transfer news. They've got the man, Stuart. Well, I think he'll fit in well to their style of play. He's a skillful player, but the move will just bring out the best of him. It's a good signing for both him and the club. And it might be really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Delivering it. Comes it short for the clearance. And it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Oliver. Ollie Lee. Committed challenge. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have... realized that was going to be offside that's a poor decision to play that pass well as you can see the visitors have had most of the ball but without really creating enough chances 
They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Well, that's a splendid piece of challenging. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. 30 minutes left for play. Ollie Lee. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. Cunningham. The timing was perfect. It had to be. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Chance to play it in. It's there for him. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, a second goal for them here. Barrett. George Baldock. Cunningham. An alert intervention. Possession one. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Space for the blades out wide. Laid into the box. Attending to his defensive chores. Opportunity. And alarmingly, that is a long way off target. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Real chance! And there it is! That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance, and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's having a tremendous game in attack, Stuart. Yeah, he's certainly carved out plenty of chances. He's tested the keeper on numerous occasions, and he got his reward with that goal. Brilliant stuff from him. Oliver. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, visionary passing. Oh, dear. A moment to forget all about, I think. Well, he has to do a lot better there. He's gone for power, but he's completely miscued it. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural break before administering the caution. <laughs> Regained possession. Well, he's outplayed and outthought him. Can he put it away? Oh, back at the net! 
and a debut goal to boot. It doesn't get much better than that. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. And intercepts again. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. Substitution time it is here. Max Emma to be replaced by number seven. And a strong tackle. Oliver. Jackson on the ball. Ollie Lee. No possibilities inside the box. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. And that's it, the final whistle, and the hosts will go through. Well, the result was never in doubt, was it? They controlled the game from start to finish, they created numerous chances, and they dictated the tempo. Of... Just a couple of questions for you. Thanks, that's all the questions we have for you.